Hey guys, so what do you think about this? A 5 amp battery. So 5,000 milliamps, is it real? They try to make it look as real as possible by giving you all this nonsense, recycle, caution, you know. And then here, I just pulled this out of a laptop. It's a dead battery, so they're still even glued together. So I basically just popped it out. But these are authentic, um, I think they're LG. Well, there's a model number, CGR1-18650CG. So you can actually look up the specs, but made in Japan, usually a little more reputable than something like this that made in China, at least they, they tell you it's made in China, but the weight is very different. Let me show you uh, what we got. Sorry about the reflection, but that's what we gotta do. So here we go. We're gonna go ahead and zero this out. And we're gonna do this in, I don't know, grams, just because they're more fine. So this one battery, 36 grams. This one battery, 42 grams. Another one, 42. And the third one, 42. So 42, 42, 42. And then 36. So why is it lighter if it's got more amps, supposedly, right? So what we'll do is we'll use this tester that I use. It's actually my favorite one, Zanflare. I'll put the link in the, the description down below. But basically, you can uh, drop the battery in, and it will give you a couple here, um, a couple options. You can charge it at um, 500 milliamps, or you can fast charge it, or you can normal test. So normal test will actually kill, um, charge the battery, kill the battery, and then recharge it and give you the true milliamps. And we can do this in 300 milliamps or 500, so we'll just do whatever, 500 uh, normal test. And we'll just load these side by side just to get a reference point on used batteries. No idea what the milliamps are. Um, I'll probably do a, a little thing for you guys and actually search online and see what the what the specs are on these. Because if it's got a part number, you can actually look it up. Um, so to get all these equalized, I'm just going to reset it real quick. They'll turn on and then I'm going to change all of these to normal tests. So it'll charge them up, then it'll discharge them up or discharge them, then charge them back up and we will have the true milliamp. Um, pretty sure this is not a 5000. So I'm going to put this on time lapse and we'll be back shortly. guys so there you have it so this one looks like i just got a there we go so 2551 milliamps here 2534 milliamps here 2490 milliamps there and look at that under 1000 milliamps and here they're trying to tell you it's got 5000 milliamps i'm here to tell you there's no battery no lithium battery that has 5,000 milliamps. So if you guys need a good source, I can help you out. You can see my batteries are all tested. And um, so um, it actually shows you here, this one took uh, 15 hours and a half, actually 15.5, 15, 15 hours and 53 minutes. So it's almost 16 hours to charge, discharge and recharge and give you the full, um, full milliamp so what i'll do is i'll write on the jacket here with a sharpie or something just so i know what the state of these batteries but these are basically 
just as good as new. I mean, these right here specifically are actually better than spec. I believe they were spec uh, 2,500. So these are practically new condition wise. This one's obviously got a little bit of use, but I mean, 2,490 out of 2,500, I believe. So that's like 98, 99% good. So this one is just junk. I throw these away. If I get batteries that I test out and those are, you know, 1000 milliamps i i toss those out so don't don't buy these don't fall for them if you need a good source let me know send me a message send me a uh, a private comment or something or just a comment i'll give you a source a link or something where you can buy these but it's a great charger if you don't have one and you deal with lithium batteries definitely get yourself one they're not too expensive i think like 30 bucks or something but uh yeah it's a great tool to have and yeah stay away from these 5,000 million power batteries. Um, thanks for watching, guys. If you liked it, please subscribe. Um, hit the like button. Send me a message. Let me know if there's anything else you want to review.